What's up, everybody? True Shot Reacts back today for another video. And today we are checking out a band that I've been meaning for us to check out here on the channel for a little while. It's a band I've never even heard, honestly. Uh, but they are releasing a new record. They've released three singles to this point, and this is the first of those three singles. So I figured, why don't we start with the first You've one? You've never heard of Kingdom of Giants? I've heard of them. I've oh, just oh, never okay. heard them. And our guy who uh, designed our most recent um, long sleeve that we'll be releasing with our next single, uh, Rui, uh, does merch for them, too. What? So, um, and Ricky Armolino did a feature on a song with them who produced our EP. EP. Lots of small world after all. Okay. It's a circle. It's, the, it's like a circle. Because it's a circle. That's kind of nice. What is that from, uh, from, uh, what, what, so, what movie is that? I now pronounce you Chuck and Larry. Yeah. It's like a circle. Because it's a circle. That's kind of nice. <laughs> anyway, so here is Next. Kingdom of Giants. All right, here we go. Let's get into it, Rich. Kingdom We're going to just take that. With, uh, Let's go. We got the screen out. Here we go. I think it's good. He's got a great voice. Come on, boys. How's that for groove? That bass. Okay. Hmm. Kingdom that, 
yeah. Giants. That was with um, sync. That was a little bit different than I was expecting. A little bit more poppy. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Remember, this was the first single that they released, so this is probably like their lead single. Uh, usually, like uh, it seems to be a kind of a, a thing where bands now like their first the single more accessible the album, song, more right? Accessible, right? Exactly. So I mean, they have a I don't want to say poppy element, but they definitely have the catchy courses in in other songs. So it wasn't a surprise, but I think. Um, I I don't know what bands have been up to this year, but with all the time, everybody's releasing bangers. Yeah. All right. Derek? Uh, no, I mean, I like the song, but it just kind of just feels like what everybody's been kind of doing lately. Like, nothing really stuck out to me. Um, mm-hmm. It's very well written. Like, the cleans were great. Sprays were great. Everything's great about it, but it's just it's very... What I've heard already because mm-hmm. like, this is the first song I've ever heard by them. Like, me too. I think this is the first time I've really heard like beginning. Yeah. To end. So like, I mean, very good, very talented. But again, I could see it's very radio friendly, accessible. Mm-hmm. Like I could see this on like the ra- like I could hear this on the radio and see like people like trying to get into them that way. It's more rocky than it is like metal corey. Right. Yeah, so I'm interested in the other two singles they released. Uh, maybe those ones uh, pick it up a little bit. For, but for me, I think. Uh, I don't know, man. I, I I know that you know with our song "Find Me Missing," we had three choruses, but they each chorus had like a different element to it, where it either was interrupted or it was overlapped. Like I don't know. I just the three chorus thing for me, it, it, it just kind of drags on a little bit for me. I knew I knew the third one was coming. I, well, you know, yeah. I mean, it was a typical. It was your typical accessible. I just, just want to call. I just want to petition right now. No more three choruses in a song. But we just did one. I know. Well, we're going to start a revolution. <laughs> <laughs> but I just, I don't know. I, I, Like you said, Derek, I felt that third one coming. I was like, well, they just did the breakdown. It'd be really cool if they went into like another heavy moment there at the end. But yeah, I, I had I was a, hoping they were going to do yeah. that. Yeah. That would have changed my mind on the song. Yeah. But, you know, it's just, I yeah. When they went back into the third chorus, I was like, all right, like, it, it wasn't a bad track by any means. But I would definitely check out the other two give them a fair shake because like i said it seems to be like that first single that bands are releasing for an upcoming album it seems to be like the more like you guys said accessible kind of um that kind of track but um yeah anything else you guys have to say i enjoyed that track okay yeah, it's a very good song i just yeah i thought it was i thought it was okay i thought it was solid i, th- I thought it was okay it, it's just solid a, it, was, it wasn't a song that i would go back and listen to what was your favorite part of the song the breakdown me too yeah 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 I, yeah. The chorus was really good, a little too rocky. Well, again, it yeah, was, it was written a certain way for accessibility. But, anyways, yeah, great All song. Right. Well, anyways, guys, make sure before you head out of here, you hit the like button, you subscribe, you turn on the notification bell, you know to find release new videos here on the channel. <laughs> also, comment down below, tell us what you thought of Kingdom of Giants and their track "Sync." We will check out the other two. I know they have yes. another one called um, "Wayfinder" and "Side Effect," I think. Um, but anyways, until then, uh, make sure you follow us on our social media accounts at True Shot Band. And we're actually live on Twitch right now recording our reactions for the week. So check us out over there, twitch.tv slash True Shot Official. And we're a band called True Shot. Check us out, Spotify, Apple Music, wherever you listen to music. Until the next one, peace. peace. Maybe I met you. Yeah.